Mmm, it's a orange juice. What's up, everyone? This is Orange Juice. A clan chest is like a shared crown chest where the entire clan can contribute the crowns to. Just like your regular crown chest, the crowns you earn in challenges or friendly battles do not add to the clan chest. You can only gain crowns on ladder. If you haven't collected your daily crown chest and you have a clan chest, the crowns you earn on ladder contribute to both. So in this case, the three crowns I won contributed to both my crown chest and my clan chest. Clan chests will start at the beginning of every season. A regular season will last 14 days. You will have 7 days to collect as many crowns as you can. After these 7 days, you can collect your crown chest reward. Once the 7 days are over, the clan chest will not reset until the next season resets. So the entire clan will get a 7 day break. If you leave your clan anytime during these 7 days and you rejoin the clan, you will be put on a cooldown period and you will not earn any rewards until the season resets, regardless of how many crowns you contributed previously before you left the clan. On the same note, if you joined a new clan, you will remain on a cooldown and you will not be legible for any rewards until the season resets. When you're on a cooldown, the crowns earned do not contribute to the clan chest. These are the rewards. There are 10 tiers of chests. So to reach the first tier of rewards, you have to collect 100 crowns. After you complete the first tier, you can unlock the second tier. You and your clan will need to collect 150 crowns to complete the second tier. If you go into the clan menu and you select the chest tab, you can see exactly who contributed and how much. If you contributed 0 crowns and your clan reaches a reward, you will not be receiving the contents of the clan chest. However, if you contribute at least one crown, that's right, just one, then you will get the full contents of the clan chest earned by your clan. The reward is the same regardless of how many members are in the clan. Trophy ranges do not matter. Your clan could be a top 200 clan and the rewards offered will still be the same. Being in Arena 1 or Arena 10 does not affect the number of cards you can receive in a clan chest, but it does limit what cards you can earn. For example, if you're in Royal Arena, your clan chest will not offer the cards above that arena, so Frozen Peak cards will remain locked. If your clan reaches the Tier 5 chest and 7 days have elapsed, the chest will be ready to open immediately. There's no cooldown timer on a crown chest. The Tier 5 chest contains 1200 cards, which will be available to every single member that is eligible. The chest reveals the total contents of its chest now. This is for all chests, even a free chest will have this feature. If your clan somehow manages to farm the tier 10 chest on the first day, it will unlock immediately. Tier 10 takes a total of 3,250 crowns to achieve. That means if you're in a clan of 50 members, in 7 days, each member just has to reach under 10 crowns per day to reach the maximum clan reward. This is pretty reasonable if you're in a full clan, where everyone collects the crown chests daily. Thanks for watching, stay tuned for more quality OJ.